This video is brought to you by Morning Brew. We have 10 exciting tech accessories to take a look at that I've organized into four categories. Chargers, iPad stands, pocket and decoration. I bet there will be at least one you've never seen, but you let me know at the end if I'm right. Okay, I'll start with the chargers category and the Pitaka Mac Easy Slider since this is easily one of my favorite tech accessories of the year. I call this a 5-in-1 charger starting off with number one, the most satisfying rotating charger with a ratchet that I tend to spin all throughout the day like a fidget spinner. The base stays in place while plugged in, but the top portion can rotate easily, delivering a very satisfying sound. The second feature of this charger is a MagSafe iPhone charger, of course. I can attach my phone to it and keep it there while working on the computer or simply use it as a stand for my phone. Number three is the magnetically attached and removable lip behind the phone stand that holds the AirPods in place while charging them. Number four, is called a power dongle, which could be purchased separately. It plugs into the side USB-C port and charges the Apple Watch. It can also be used on the computer when on the go, and it's definitely something to keep in the backpack. Number five is that the base for the iPhone is an actual removable power bank that can stay attached to the phone and provide an additional 4000 mAh of juice. Talking about versatility here, the side USB-C port can also be used with a cable to charge whatever the heart desires. In the mornings before I fire up the laptop, I tend to snap my phone into the stand and while sipping an espresso, go over the news provided by Morning Brew. Morning Brew is a free daily newsletter delivered Monday through Sunday that makes reading the news actually enjoyable. As someone who stays away from social media as much as possible, religiously avoiding the television, I appreciate the entertaining business, finance and tech news bites that can be easily digested via Morning Brew. For example, I discovered a book called indestructible how to control your attention and choose your life which contains loads of actionable tips on turning distraction into traction all thanks to an interview with the author near ale published past sunday morning grew is witty relevant and informative and there's really no reason not to subscribe it takes less than 15 seconds so click on the first link in the description below to receive morning brew's daily email absolutely free The Nomad Base One charger is the tux wearing charger in this category. This extremely sophisticated MFI MagSafe charger provides up to 15 watts of power. It comes with a weighted metal body and an elevated glass panel designed to complement any space. I prefer the Panda black and white model, but it also comes in white. There's no trickery to this honest charger, weighing at an over one pound. It stays anchored to its surface when grabbing the phone, emitting nothing but class. There's also a max version of the base one, which adds an additional pound of weight, but more importantly, a place to charge the Apple Watch as well. On a serious note, I'm trying to up my returning viewers as only 16% of you managed to find me again and again. If you end up enjoying this video and you wanna find out what's next on the channel, subscribe and click on the bell icon because why not? Going back to Pitaka for a moment, I'd like to show you the Mac Easy Car Mount Pro. I've tried numerous car chargers over the years, yet most of them fall short in the attachment department, especially regarding stability. Cool. The innovative hook system on this charger attaches firmly to different car vents, ensuring a much more steady experience. What I like most is the size of the product and the fact that it takes almost as much space as the size of MagSafe, no unnecessary bulk. It is compact and inconspicuous, and it offers 15 watts of power, although it is limited to 7.5 for the iPhone. It even has a built-in cooling fan that reduces heat as you wireless charge. It includes sensors that detect an increase in temperature, voltage and current to protect the phone while driving. Moving on to iPad stands, I currently go back and forth between two. The first one, as you can guess, is again by Bitaka, who by the way are not sponsoring this video, but are just crazy good when it comes to magnets. It is called the Mac Easy Stand and I've featured it in more than one video as my favorite at-home stand for the iPad Pro. It can be used with Pitaka's iPad case, which comes with a special attachment and alignment magnets on the back, or with just a sticker if you wanna use it in that case. The stand keeps the iPad firmly in place and rotates and swivels for optimal positioning. If it's not enough, it also comes with a wireless charger on the bottom with again, built-in fan to cool whatever devices you're charging. But what happens if you want to use a stand on the go? This is where Moft jumps into the equation. Moft is also crazy good when it comes to magnetic solutions, by the way. Their latest float stand is the ultimate on-the-go prop and stand that can help you lift up the iPad 
that to a laptop level or lean it in pretty much any position and direction. As with the Pitaka stand, it works with the additional case for the tablet or with just a sticker that can be placed on the back of the tablet. Let's talk about pocket organization. The essential company here is OrbitKey with their unique Star Wars limited drop in collaboration key organizer. These limited edition organizers celebrate the endless stories and timeless characters of Star Wars in an elegant and understated design. If you've never used OrbitKey before, be sure to check them out as I find them the best key organizer organizers that are also useful. There's no key scratching or pocket key rattling. Everything stays in place and most of all it is easy to find and use right away. My special edition version of the key organizer is the Mandalorian. It features a charcoal crazy horse leather band with brown stitching that resembles the bounty hunter's armor. The key organizer is attached to Orbit Key's Clip version 2, which thanks to the secure magnetic Fidlock's quick release system comes on and off the lightweight carabiner that stays attached to my jeans. Depending on my outfit and use case, I can attach the keys to my backpack in less than a second and detach them when needed. As I mentioned earlier, thanks to the key organizer, nothing is loose and everything fits and stays in place. On the keychain, I also keep a leather AirTag holder by again Orbit key to get notified should I forget my keys, let's say, at home. All right, let's talk about decoration. I've recently received two almost equally sized items that have been missing in my home studio. I'll start with the more memorable and less interactive piece of tech, more specifically, framed piece of tech by Grid Studio. This is well-designed thick frame that holds the original Game Boy. Grid Studio restores old and classic tech, turning them into timeless art. You can choose smartphones like the original iPhone or Nokia or Blackberry or consoles like the original Nintendo, which was a massive part of my childhood and really something that I cherished. Now I get to remember the good old days from my childhood every time I glance at my wall. It's an excellent gift for anyone, including yourself. Like some other items that I've showed you so far, it looks fantastic no matter where you place it. The next more interactive piece of nostalgia is by a company called Devoom and the product is Pixo 64. This is a Wi-Fi pixel digital frame that I can control to display pretty much anything with my phone. Devoom has an extensive library of art created by the community, yet if that's not enough, I can create one myself. This 64 by 64 pixel frame is entertaining to glance at. The only regret I have is that it's an entire LCD panel and not individually lit lights. Anyway, was there something that you've never seen before? Let me know in the comment section below. And also check out my favorite MagSafe accessories video, which gained great popularity on YouTube. If you have any questions, let me know in the comment section below. And if you got this far, subscribe. As always, it's been an absolute pleasure. This is E, over and out.